Well, we do have some breaking news. Harris Teeter announced it's requiring employees to wear masks or other face coverings at work. That includes stores and distribution centers. This weekend, I saw most employees already doing that. Here in North Carolina, more people are being tested for the coronavirus. CBS 17 digital data reporter Jody McCreary is digging deeper and finds the percentage of people who test positive is going up. One way to measure how coronavirus is spreading is with the positive test rate. That's the percentage of people tested for the virus who are confirmed to have it. And while that number is climbing, the data shows North Carolina is still doing better than some of its neighbors. Today in North Carolina, we had about 6,800 total positives in 79,000 tests for a positive rate of 8.5%. That's better than some of the states nearby. South Carolina had a positive testing rate of 10.8%. Virginia's rate is at 15%. And in Georgia, 23% of their tests have come back positive. But one doctor I spoke to says the accuracy of this number depends on which people are taking those tests. And I think across the whole comparison across states, across counties and whatever, I mean, the whole big issue is who are you testing? Now, the number of tests has increased, and along with that, the rate in North Carolina has gone up. A month ago, it was a little over 4%, and two weeks ago, it was 7% before reaching 8.5 today. And in the full story on our website, we'll tell you how that compares to the national average. Find it at cbs17.com.